cool. He's safe from coronavirus. He's picking that stuff up. Wow. Hope he doesn't throw it. Recycling place. Some ATVs over there. I think that was here the last time I was here. A couple ATVs. Someone dropped off. Right there. A small one. He said this was a two-stroke. That was here last time I was here. Might be worth the investment. I don't know. <laughs> Two dollars and forty cents a pound. It's a pretty cheap investment. Yep. All those cement mixer drums over there. Well, I used to drive us. Cement makes your truck. I got my hard hat on. You gotta wear one when you're here. Yep. Look at these drums over here. Look at the pile of uh, not some heavy metal. God. Put my gloves on now. It's freaking heavy. It's an interesting place out here, man. There's a roll bar over there. Look at all these mixer drums over here. Like a little cubby of them. Ready mix, that's a company I used to work for. Oh wow. It's a wheelchair. Looks like somebody was hiding it. I'm gonna come back and get that thing. It's nice. Yep, I'm gonna get it right now. Guys moving stuff. Got the electrical thing. There's a Toro lawnmower. Pretty cool. Pretty neat, yeah. Big old pile of, it's that thing I was walking through the other day. Right there. Almost lunchtime, the guy said. From 12 to 12:30. So they got 15 minutes. Here's a pile of bikes. Damn. Looks like a BMX one right there on the top. Chris was talking about my friend. I'm 
and get it, see what it looks like. I don't know. It's like freaking plastic. Oh, that's metal. Oh, that's metal. Let's see. It's got freaking alloy wheels. I'm on the top of the mountain. I don't know if I could see. It's 20 inch wheels though. I think I'm gonna get it. I think. camera in my hand. Oh, it's got like the forks up the front of Pretty cool. Pretty good shape. Huh. Yeah, frame straight. Got alloy wheels on it. I'm gonna get that, get him picking up a huge pile. Now we'll come back over. Another bike right there, mongoose. It's not bad, it's just a frame. Got the alloy rims on it. Oh well. Get freaking wheels. Thought about that the other day. Right there. That one's bent though. Clutch plate. Yep. There was a ton of wheels here the other day. Here's some right here. It's like Chevy wheels, truck wheels. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Eight holes on there. There's the other one. There's the third one. Oh, pardon me. Yeah, there's a the third one. Here's the fourth one. Yep. Right there. Stuff looks old over here, rusty, older. Whatever that is. It's like an old piece of farm farm machinery with that handle right there. Look at that. See? It's the handle. I don't know what that is. That's some strange farming equipment.
back then. My dad would probably know know what it is. He kind of grew up on a farm. Yep. I know where that other wheel is. I think somebody would buy a set of those wheels. I don't know if they'd buy three. Some big ass stuff over here. Well, that guy's moving stuff again over here. Bunch of disc brakes right there. Pick it up. I think he is. He's just thinking about it. I'm getting in the right position. There we go. Picking that stuff up. Wow. Hope he doesn't throw it. Like a broom. Taking the shortcut. It's a cable. Interesting. It's all rusty. Huh. Like 
golf cart. It's got that electric engine in there. It might be worth getting it and digging that thing out. I don't know much about them though. I'm sure they're not too complicated. TV over here. This was here last time. Here's an engine. They got tons of engines here. Damn, look at this where they cut out pieces of metal. And this is like the leftover they brought here. It's a big, huge pile. They're cutting out letters here, D's. Huh. Here's the ATV. I think it's a Chinese one, the guy said. Still here after about a week. Yeah. There's one of those crushing machines. Right here. Put everything in there and then crush it. Squeeze it together. I'm gonna see them use it though. There's all those disc brakes. Huh. My friend watched the video, he said it reminded him of Sanford and Son. things where they were cutting them out like a laser I've seen guys do that it's computer operated low rider wheel wheels right here finally Those were expensive back in the day. Here's a dumbbell. Old toolbox here. Tons of nuts and bolts. And two of them. Huh. Right there. My dad used to collect. Tons of nuts and bolts and stuff. Damn, look at all that. This old bench right here. That could be fixed up and sold. And the road is closed with bullet holes in it. Right next to the 10 pound weight. Yeah. Jumper cables. box right there staring right in my face like a snake whoa yeah I can actually use that Seasoned well. Huh. Must have come in with these other toolboxes. Interesting. Pretty cool. He's safe from coronavirus. All these 
bolts on the ground here. I'm at the second recycling place. All right, that doesn't fit. Get all this. Huh. Probably fit one of them. that Edel Black Performer it's like 60 bucks well, there's another one over here Ooh, there's some bicycles right there Dang. Somebody set them off to, to the side. Huh. Nice. Rally. And Kent. Second mountain going over here. It's the bottom of a lawnmower. Yeah, it kind of kicks when people are bringing stuff in, like these guys. Bikes up there ground a bit. Here's one right here. Freaking bent to pieces. Oh, 
damn, there's an ATV right in front of me. Like right there. It's like a Chinese one. The tires are good. I don't think it's twisted up yet. Not yet. Ah, the monster. I don't want to make it obvious that was. Here he comes. Hello. Sweeping it clean. Pretty cool. This pile of used metal. Pretty cool. Stuff is old and rusted through. Yeah, it's metal. Hot water heaters. Yeah. I just dumped off a bunch of uh, washing machines. Here's the rest of those bolts. Freaking tons of them dumped off here. Wow. Freaking huge, too. Wow. Look at all that. Huh. Could they haven't even been used either. Yep. Well, that is interesting. These things are huge. I guess you call them I beams. Here's our second mountain. Stuff over here. There's, a, there's an ATV on the top. Looks like it's been tore to pieces. Along with the whatever bikes they've got over here. Oh god. Great. Here's a Huffy. Dirt bike right there. Had gears on it. Something else right there. Another one right there. Huh. Found this Huffy dirt bike. It's pretty good. I checked the wheels. They're, they're actually straight. Those new ones up there, the some of the employees are saving. They're like freaking brand new. Actually, not bad. I don't know how in demand a Huffy dirt bike is, but 20 inch wheels on it. And then I'm over here in the edge. Freaking tons of like riding mowers over here. Husqvarna, shoot, that's a the engine's up in there. It's good. Yeah, look at all that. Uh, Freaking rebar over there. Tons of it. My first job I ever had working for a company that sold 
mesh the trucks would have rebar in it when they'd come in then by mesh where you put it in the concrete along with the rebar yep all right it's actually a third little mountain over here stuff that's a craftsman looks similar to one that I, that guy gave me uh, Ken gave me so that's a V motor on that one Huh. Interesting. That bike right here. It's like all aluminum. It's got some good parts on it. They bent the hell out of that wheel. Uh, it's a good size Shimano. Those are like perfectly good. All three gears straight. I mean, probably give it to you for like five or ten bucks or less. That's bent right there. I mean, it's probably bent back. I don't know. I'm going to look around a little more. 31 pounds. He charged me nine bucks. Pretty good deal. All right. Cool.